How's it going guys? Welcome to another episode of Prelude Vibes. Little Prelude right here, got the Mustang right here. Toyota. But we're working on the Subaru today. We're gonna see if it has a blown head gasket. So we're, what I'm gonna do is uh, a block test real quick. If you guys don't know how to do a block test, I'll teach you guys. This is like my third one. So if you guys uh, have any suggestions, go ahead. Leave leave the comment below, you know, and I'll take note, you know. So we're going to warm this up a little bit. And see what happens. Got 146,165. Make sure it's in a neutral there. We don't want to launch forward. Starts starts up pretty quick, pretty good. Cool. Alright guys, before anything. This is how the engine sounds like underneath the engine bay. If you're able to see that, I don't see the bubbles. Ladies and gentlemen. gentlemen, this is what we need. We got a combustion leak test fluid here and then a giant turkey baster right here so we put the fluid in here fill it up to the line fluid level through there and then I'll show you what's next we'll Wait a minute. Wait a minute. So it's going to look something like this. Okay. And then we put this end on the radiator, the top, uh, where the radiator cap is, right there while the engine's running and then we suck air like that oh <laughs> well it needs to stay together you know what i mean and then we're gonna fill up to the line So we got that. And it's supposed to suck in combustion air through the radiator. Alright guys, so we're going to try it from this port, top side, we're going to squeeze up here and it's going to suck in air and we're going to see if there's any combustion gases. If this fluid changes color, it means we have combustion gases in the cooling system, possibly, most likely a head gasket.
about saying blue, so I'm hoping that's some good news. We're good. I'm gonna. We tested the top side one. Now we're gonna test the radiator side. Putting some new uh, new fluid in there. Watch out, Miles. We'll fill it up to the line. Okay. Put that there. We're gonna get little people away. We're gonna start this thing, and then we're gonna see if uh, this thing turns color, turns a different color. If it turns a different color, then again, we might have a head gasket issue. Same blue, so it might be good. guys so um, after doing the block test uh, I'm gonna go take this thing for a drive see if uh, it starts overheating if it starts overheating eat like easily if that needle starts shooting up I'm gonna have to pull over but it'll indicate that we have some some sort of issue but I'm trying to like you know eliminate the possibility that a head gasket issue is there you know so that's where I'm at in temperature yes. I'm gonna go drive it four miles and then I'll show you guys where the temperature is at all right guys so I'm driving this thing temperature gauge looks like it's at operating temperature I'm not lying, see? I'm driving, there's cows all over. Ladies, gentlemen, stop by to get this thing washed. And it was pretty dirty. Parked underneath the tree, so all the trees have kind of landed on it. Um, I did run out of time on this side. I do have a little bit of soap left, but it'll air dry. I hope. <laughs> Alright guys, let's drive this thing back. We'll see what it's, what's up. So, I'm back home. And uh, there's a temperature gauge. No. No change. Halfway 
operating temperature I'm guessing so yeah guys uh, I guess that's how you use a uh, block tester um, if I have any more overheating issues I will continue doing uh, any more diagnosis but at the moment I don't know I don't know what it could be I think I just drove this like what um 20 20 miles I don't know let's see I'll, I'll give you guys the, the mileage to do the math from earlier alrighty guys so that's gonna be it for this video um, that's how you use a combustion leak tester or a block tester um, hope you guys enjoyed the video you guys have an awesome weekend please stay safe out there if there's any more issues with this car I'll, I'll make more videos <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm gonna make more videos um, you guys stay awesome out there peace